I sense a quest. Is there a land where I might find more of your kind? More of my kind? Curious place for a conversation about art. Anywhere is good for that. It's simply a matter of summoning inspiration. Vodka, for example, is a great aid. Care to drink with us? To poetry? Gladly. Why not? I am a bit thirsty. And when a man is thirsty, melancholy strangles his soul. Poor Gascoigne! Oh dear, I appear to be drunk. Gentlemen, I am soused, pickled, crotched, and stewed. Oh. <laughs> Want another term for your state? Don't be vulgar. What will our new friend think? Pour another. Get him down. <laughs> if I get drunk here, I'm going to get robbed, I suspect. Uh, Tadra Kagan, thank you very much for the Twitch Prime sub. Seven months as well. Thanks, man. That's that's awesome. Thank you very much. That should. Yes, it has. Just checking that my, my notification bar is working now on screen as well. Thank you very much for that. Highly appreciate it. Uh, it Geralt, Geralt likes a drink. If I... Oh, last round. Go on then. Let's let's go one more. Fine. Last round for me though. <laughs> He's proper sozzled. Hey up. Have they robbed me? Oh, they robbed. Well, I hope it's is gone. As are the troubadours, and my things. I knew it. Damn it. But there's going to be a story in this, so it's going to be fine. I'm going to get it back with interest. Novigrad Hospitality. Let's track that quest. Track down the bards using your Witcher senses and recover your equipment. I don't think we have to go very far, right? <laughs> you always enjoy my content. Cheers. Thanks, Tay. That's that's uh, nice to hear. Okay. Smile, fair as oh. spring. As towards him he draws you His tongue sharp and silvery Here we go Hey there, sir, a witcher, right? Wait um, I'm kind of, kind of uh, off duty at the moment I shall come back and get Oh god, I need to What have we got? Just rubbish? Fine, man needs a wife Right They've gone straight to the inn Well, that, that figures Know what rhymes with wicked witcher? My things before I turn you into mincemeat. <laughs> Must be a slant rhyme. Shut your trap and give it back. So then, we are square, even good, yes? We'll be good once you give me your, your things. Yeah, we're good. Get out of here before I change my mind. Of course, Master Witcher. We're off. One, two, gone already. They did give me a crap ton of vodka. But you fairness in your eyes. I've never seen that so strangers in the land. Out of its first decree, okay. raises taxes. Thought there might be something more to that. Have I been here before? The elderman. Bailiff's a harsh man. Best not cause any trouble at the inn. Bertram, let's talk to Bertram. Let's not talk to Bertram. There's someone to talk to here. Is it? Who is it? Not him. Must be this guy, peasant. What's the problem? Oh, nothing. On your way now, good man. Shut it, Gotthard. He could help. Little Red's band means to attack no. the village. Want revenge on Bertram. We haven't much, but we're willing to pay if you defend us. Who's Little Red? And why do they want revenge? Who's Little Red? Word is she fornicates with wolves and can tear a man apart with her bare mitts. A she-beast in human husk. Though some call her a great beauty. She leads a pack of deserters. True dregs from different armies. The kind what knows killing and plundering well. Fornicates with wolves, eh? I guess that's what they call dogging, right? Is that what the cool kids call dogging? I don't know. I don't know. I'm a respectable man. I don't know these things. Why does this band want revenge on you of all people? Because... Because I ratted on them to the witch hunters. 
Witch hunters care about bandits? Hmm. Since when? Little Red's band, they was terrorizing our village. We had none to defend us. Finally, Bertram went by the hunters, asked them. So the hunters went after him. We had a spell of peace, but now Little Red's learnt of it all. Wants to kill Bertram. He's done for if you don't help. I don't know. Yeah, I um, want to help. Not really my sort of thing, is it? But fine, I'll handle the bandits. Go to your homes, bar the doors. I suppose it's a job. Nature. They're the dangerous type, truly. It's not really Witcher What's work, this. But so uh, wait until dusk for Little Red's band to come. It's it's 10 a.m. Uh, let me go and see if I can find somewhere to get fixed up. Actually, I've probably got time to travel to Novigrad and back. Hang on, who's that? Evil soft first touches. Meet Master Mirror. At midnight at the crossroads. I need to come back here anyway. So, um, yeah, let's go to... I don't need the stash. There. I'll go to this gate and it's just over the road. Over the bridge, rather. Yep, let's go. To death on three pounds of steel. Thank you very much. I think I'll pass on your very generous offer for now. Right, I should have... I don't know, the peasants in this game, they never leave off, do they? They never give Nothing you a break. You. Spitting at you, threatening you. Greetings, Ibeer. Let's get this Greetings, stuff sold. Geralt. How might I be of help? Well, I want something repaired. Listen, would you craft something for me? Let's go to repair. Just repair all. Ooh, that's expensive. That is damned expensive. Now let's go to the shop bit. What have I got? He's got 16 grand. Okay. Let's have a clear out here. Order of the Flaming Rose Sword. I don't have as much valuable stuff as I would really like. Uh, five percenters. I never use armor piercing. I'm selling that one. Staggers. Two percent. They can go. Anything less than five percent now is just, it's not enough. We've moved on from that. Ten armor piercing. Ah, uh, this is getting me some money back. This is doing the work. Where did I get all this rubbish low-level stuff from? I thought I sold all this before. And 23. I've got 23 repair kits and I'm worried about using these. See, this is what I mean about me being a terrible, terrible hoarder. I've been saving all these and then spending the money at the thing. In case, you know, I might need to repair in the middle of a boss fight. I am hopeless. I've got to learn just to use my stuff. One of those Order of the Flaming Rose gauntlets. Need to be 36 for them. I think I can sell all this armor as well. Let's get rid of all that. Nice, that's cleaned him out of about six grand. Anything else that we can get rid of? 10% Axie. It's nice when you get 10% upgrades on that, but uh, it's not the stuff I want. 19 Amateur's Armor Repair Kit. Yes, I've got to learn. Learn just to give up stuff. I've also got... Oh, I thought I might have a ton of weight in crafting stuff there. Not so much. Okay, that'll do. So long. Right, then back across that bridge. Now I remember the way. Long hey, Deathman. Nice to see you. How's things with you tonight? There you go. People spit at me again as I run past. Who the hell? Are they just, they've just burnt someone else outside of the town. Nice. Nice. Who was it? Uh, someone on YouTube asking for a barbecue. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Geralt's getting barbecued as well now. Getting a little bit warm. Was it Sylvan? I think it was Sylvan. 
asking me on the, on the YouTube comments under Yo Hanker's quest from Kingdom Come Deliverance if there was going to be a barbecue. Let's get back there. About 2.45pm for you. You now have a cold compress on your arms. What's happened, Deathman? Have you got sunburned? Or just like uh, some sort of muscle injury? You messed up this morning? This sounds pretty grim, man. What is it? I'm still going to wait till dusk. You were outside for three hours. And that was enough to get like, uh, oh, serious sunburn. What's the temperature with you? Yeah, I know what it's like. I unfortunately haven't been sunburnt for a long time. Partly because it's, it can be quite tricky to get sunburnt in the UK. I'm going to go and explore this place here, and then we're going to meditate and hang around till dusk. You know what somebody once told me that was really good for sunburn, and I haven't tried this? Um, oatmeal. Wet oatmeal on it. Oh. Come here, bilge hag. Where is she? You missed me that time, you old hag. And I missed you, so we're even. Come here. There we go. Ow! There we go. That's the one. <laughs> Get behind and... Whoa! I love doing those big, heavy attacks from behind. It's a shame I can't sprint around a bit faster. Have one of those. These blocks burn so well. Oop. Smack. Got her. <laughs> 86 degrees. Okay, that's that's pretty warm. Yeah, I guess if you get caught out without any sun cream on, it's uh, it's easy to burn out for a long time. The worst sunburn I think I ever had was when I was on honeymoon. We went to Tobago in the Caribbean. And we're, we were very careful. We had this Factor 30 stuff that you put on. It's called P20. It was, I think it was fairly new at the time. And you put it on once in the morning, and it was good for all day. That was the, that was the thing about it. And it was about 95% waterproof or something. And we were fine all the way through the holiday until the very last day, when we just stayed in the sea a little bit longer than normal. And then uh, we're walking back to the hotel afterwards with a rucksack on, and I'm thinking... Hmm, that's, that's starting to itch a little bit. So that rucksack's rubbing on my back. And after about half an hour of walking further, it was really starting to be obvious what had happened. And I got took my shirt off in the hotel room. Back at my back was just bright red. It was uh, it was kind of sore. Whether the stuff had just washed off, or, or whether it stayed in the sea too long, or what, I don't know. But God damn, that burnt. And I had the bright idea of putting the after sun stuff in the fridge to cool it down because I thought that'll soothe it better, that'll take the sting out. Big mistake. Big mistake. That uh, that really hurt putting that stuff on. Let's try 9pm for this meeting. In fact, there's a picture of me somewhere lying on the bed with a bright red back. My wife's drawn a smiley face with the after sun cream. <laughs> yeah. He has a hell of a sense of humour. Oh, did I forget the chest? Did I forget the chest in the bushes by those that thing? Oi, bandit. Where's little Red? There she is. Did the villagers hire you? Word is you got a lot of common with mon a lot in common with monsters. They did, to defend them from monsters and humans who can be monsters. And you believe me to be such? Are you? Find out for yourself if you dare. Or give me Bertram. No one else will get hurt. It's little red riding hood. What did Bertram do? Let's find out. What did Bertram do to you to warrant vengeance? Uh, mean they didn't mention this bit? Then listen. He came to me a half year back. Said he'd point out who's worth looting. In return for a share of the takings. 
But some time on, the bugger grew greedy. He wanted more. I refused. That's when he set the witch hunters on us. Lost half me men because of him. She's a bandit. They now both step want killing. Aside, Witcher. This ain't your affair. We want Bertram. No one else. Give my word. Hmm. What should I do, chat? What do you reckon? I got the chest, did I? Thanks. Thanks, I wasn't paying enough attention. Um, do I trust them? They have been robbing from these people, but that was kind of Bertram's fault. Let's say do what you gotta do. I won't get in your way. Do what you gotta. Right, decision. I wasn't too sure them. about taking this on to start with. If they start murdering the rest of the villagers, though, that's a different See? matter. Quick and painless. That's for you. For understanding. I got one experience. Let's go, for that. gents. Hmm. I dare say I'm not very popular in this place now. Is it the bandits you witches work for now? Now, now. Here, piss off now. now. They're not very happy. Nuff, sis, my ass. Oh, they've gone. That was that was kind of weird. I've never seen I've never seen that before. I've never seen him despawn like that. That's really weird. I don't know if I did the right thing there. Never sure if I do the right thing. Kill them all? I think AFK Potato. I think that was a great idea. I should have killed the bandits and then gone and killed Bertram as well. That's what I should have done. Okay, let's um, let's go to the crossroads. There's nothing else to do around here for a bit. don't think I've got time to get all the way up there. Oh, who am I kidding? Let's get Roach. I've got time to do this. Where is he? I say he. I think I think Roach is now a Nilfgaardian Black Stallion. Although I can't tell with the outfit that uh, he's got on. I think so. I think it's a different Roach. It was supposed to be a different Roach. Whether it actually is or not, I don't know. When I saw these fields of sunflowers and uh, those peasants recruited me for a quest. I thought it was going to be from a little a little short story from one of the books where they ask you to chase this devil out of their crops. And it turns out to be a... Um, oh, what they're called. They're called, they're called satyrs in um, different mythology. Sylvans in this. What have we found? We found a monster cave here. It's a really cool short story, but uh, it's not. Yeah, no, I know. They're gone. Those... those Peasants, after they shouted and swore at me, just vanished. That was kind of weird. Oh, hang on. Hang on, we want Igni, and we want Insectoids. Seen a lot more Insectoid stuff up here um, than I've ever seen before. If only I can remember what the oil looked like. That one. Satyrs or Fawns? Um, good question. What's the difference? I suppose Mr. Tumnus from Narnia is a fawn. Satyrs are a bit a bit larger, aren't they? I don't know, actually. The only satyrs that I've ever come across were in a game called Legends of Valor back on the Amiga, and that was from, like, a long time ago. I need to get some power here. Go whirly gig time. That's the way to do it. <laughs> that worked quite well. Dude's still burning. Yep. Trapped against the wall, set him on fire. I like stuff that's flammable. Fits my playstyle. I'll come back to that dude in a minute. Love the glowing sword. That must be from the oils I'm using, right? I don't think it's the, the sword itself. Oh, he's, he's dragging me to his mates. Nice. Hang on, am I pressing the right button? Yeah, I am. But I'm just not hitting anything, so that's not much good. Oh, no, that's even worse. Hang on, I'm being made a fool of here. Hang on a minute, I've had enough of this. Nope, nope, nope. I'm going to get into big trouble. Let's stun something. Oh, I'll give it a break. I can't get a 
piss on these damn things. Damn greased spiders. That might be it for me. Time for a swallow. Let's get uh, some more of this on, I think. I should be... It's my own fault. I should be... I should be quick enough to dodge that. Wow! Um, I didn't think I had the range to get that guy at the back. There we go. Oh, his mates come as well. <laughs> Freeze them and cook them. That's the way to do it. This one here? Oh, that must be something up on the surface. I think. So, sat as a font. It depends if you're Roman or Greek in origin. Ah, okay. So, what, they pretty much the same thing? Hey, Draugr. Nice to see you. Generally speaking, fauns were more about sex and chasing nymphs, while satyrs were a tad bit more materialistic. I think these are more like satyrs, but they're called sylvans in this game. I've met two. Uh, one was the... was it called the All God? Or the One God? I can't remember. That was from a very early on quest in, in Velen, which is a really funny, really funny one. Um, and the rest was from the entrance to Bald Mountain. He then attacked me. And of course we had to kill him. But look at that sword. That sword just just there. Where's the camera gone? I can't, I can't do it. I wish I could just place the camera perfectly. Oh, that's nice. Anything else in here? It's a different way out. There's the last one of these things, I think. Smacky time. Is it going to be a nest? Ooh, this one looks... A little bigger. We'll get him in the corner. These, this guy's like tough. But dumb. I think it's because he's frozen. I think I got him because he was frozen. Right, we're done in here, right? Let's get the hell out of here. The hell is that? Okay, so I need... Oh, I need to go back and find that dead body and get a key off him. Both were half goat, half human. Note to self, don't use the dish rags for cold compresses. You've got broccoli bits on your arm. Well, you know, if you get a little bit peckish. Um, but yeah, try that Try that oatmeal thing. Just soak the oatmeal in, in cold water, really cold water, and apply that. I think... I can't remember where I read that, but I've, I'm sure I've heard of a couple of people using it. Okay, see you later, Trollsium. Nice to see you tonight. Hope you're well, my friend. A yellowed letter. Mate, if you're reading this letter, it means you're a free man. New Dragon Ball could never break you. I feel damn bad it was you they fingered back then. Fate's a bitch at times, ain't she? But you're a made man now. I hid your part of the loot in that cave, blah, blah, blah. I know where the cave is. I know, I know where it is. I should go and get this stuff, actually, because these, these guys are dropping more mutagens. I don't know if that's particularly vital at this part of the game, but uh, they're quite handy to have. Let's see where we're going. Put that damn sword away. Run faster. Hmm. Fairly pretty cave. Right, it was around here somewhere. Nice, 456 florins. And then I've just got time to get back as well. For the next quest at midnight. Sorry, I just, I just had this image of uh, Deathman sitting there now, painting cold oatmeal up and down his arms. It's a, it's a true tip. I'm not winding you up. I, I believe, in all honesty, that that's, that's supposed to help. Let's but it just, go. just conjure up quite a funny image. Slow now. I'm going to try putting lotion on before the oatmeal. That's, that's a, probably a good idea. When the ocean, lotion doesn't work. Oatmeal. It's the future. 
Right then, let's get straight down there. Quite like how Novigrad's all lit up in the background. Burns need a lot of moisture. Moisture and uh, cool, gotta get the temperature down quick. 